Hi, my name is Tyler Moore, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to make this website step-by-step -step with no step skipped. So this is my dad and brother's plumbing website, and I wanted to show you guys how to make a real website that's live and out there on the internet, rather than a fake website that's just filled with random pretty nature images, because a real website is a lot harder to make than a fake one, obviously. Uh, because with a real website, you need people to call or email or buy something in a fake website. It just, it isn't a real business. So of course, I'm going to show you how to make this website step by step. But before I do that, I want to tell you why I think this website performs so well. Nearly everyone who goes to this website calls. So before we begin, I wanted to go over why I think this website gets better results than most websites and how yours can also. Of course, you don't need to make a plumbing website. You can make any website you want. The principles are the same. And the first principle is simplicity. Simplicity is the key to this website. Just like Google or Apple, Airbnb or Skype, we need to keep things simple to get our message across easily and clearly. We all have millions of things to do. Navigating a cluttered website shouldn't be one more thing. And the second principle is they're being genuine. They're not trying to be something that they aren't. Their business is a small business. I see so many businesses try to become someone they aren't. They try to appear bigger than they are and be corporate. They get fake stock images and no one believes they're real, but they try to trick people into believing that they're this huge corporation. Once we decided to be genuine and real with people, the website did so much better. That's your advantage against big corporation. Your advantage is that you're a real person, not a faceless corporation. So use your advantage and don't bury it, but accentuate it. You can use your face on your website and get way more sales or calls or emails than you could if you showed a huge corporate office. This website also works on every computer, tablet, and phone, including Macs, PCs, Linux, tablets, Androids, iPads, iPhones, and all other mobile devices and everything else. It is super mobile friendly, so everyone can access it. This website is also built in WordPress, which is the same technology that Fortune 500 companies and professional web developers use. It is by far the most popular technology for building websites used today. And of course, you can build this website on nearly any computer, a Mac, a PC, or Linux. Basically, if you can watch this video, you can build the website. So let's take a tour of this website to see the types of things that we can build. So we're going to learn how to put in and create your logo right here. We're going to learn how to create all of your different pages and put some sort of call to action up here, like your phone number or maybe a button or whatever you want. We're going to learn how to put in a huge image with your headline here and your subheadline, and maybe even a video for you, even though you don't have to, uh, that pops up automatically and auto plays a YouTube video. Father and son, Dan and Danny, are the ones to pick up the phone and come to your home. Then we're going to learn how to put in your paragraph right here that has a lot of spacing on the top and on the bottom that really makes it easy to read what you have to offer. We're going to learn how to put in another one of your images and a headline and a subheadline and a call to action to see all of your products or services. Then we're going to learn how to put in your headline and all of your different products or services. We can describe right here and another big image with a call to action and a learn more call to action if they don't want to call you or buy just yet. Then we're going to learn how to put in another title for you and a simple paragraph that describes all about you and your company and maybe some fun images of you uh, if you want. So I really love this because it's spaced out perfectly so it looks really cool. Then another call to action and we're also going to learn how to create a contact page where they can get into contact with you. They could get your uh, email and phone number and maybe location if you have one and a map of uh, where you live an interactive map so you can zoom up and drag it around and a contact form so people can contact you we're also going to learn how to put in your footer here your logo or social media icons and all of your different links at the bottom and a copyright and your website so uh, if we fill this out it can send to us and people can contact you easily and you can do business 
via email. And we can see that we have a new email from one of our potential customers or maybe someone bought a product from us. And it emails it just like that. All right, once we have done that, let's take the tour of how it looks on the mobile version. So this is what it will look like on your phone. And as you can see, there is different content than there was on the desktop. That play button isn't there and this call is here and this video is embedded instead of the play button because the desktop version and the mobile version uh, of your website are not going to work the same the desktop version is not going to work perfectly on the mobile version we need the ability to display different content on the mobile version on people's phones than we would on the desktop version so that's what we've done here we have the ability to control what it looks like mobily and what it looks like on the desktop. So we have this click to call, and we can call. So that's really cool because people on the go, they can't really copy and paste or just dial it in. Uh, we also have this video embedded right into the website instead of using that play button. So we can click it, when something goes and it'll wrong just start playing. Home, you can always find a plumber And we can put it sideways if we want. But not always one that you can trust. And do whatever we want with it. So this paragraph is the same, and this is the same, but it is resized. This experience is resized. We can still click on services to see all of the services, and it responds because it's a responsive website, so it changes its layout based on how big the screen is. So that works perfectly. And we've changed this image to add more space to the top right here so that the calls could be on the top instead of in the middle because there's just not enough space. So we can learn more and most of this is the same except for the images here we don't have that four images we have them all on top of each other which looks really good and of course you can click to call again and for the contact page we have a menu up here that we can see and we can click to call and or we can go to the contact page and everything uh, is normal. We didn't have to change anything here. So we can fill out the form, we can do the map or whatever we want. So it looks really great on the mobile version and we have this mobile menu up here that we can click and hide and change the colors to and I show you how to do all of that. So that is the mobile version of the website and it's super important for it to not only be responsive, which means it changes the size of the text and the size of the images for your cell phone and tablet devices, but also that we can display different content on our phones than we do on our desktop.